five hours till showtime, and the star is on his way. Brother Mike Velarde, millionaire real estate agent and media mogul, is on a mission from God. This is not a pop concert. This is the church Brother Mike built, El Shaddai. It's now a multi-million dollar evangelical empire revolutionising the Philippines. And this is probably the largest weekly mass in the world. While the faithful rev up outside, backstage, Brother Mike is preparing too. His followers believe he performs miracles, making the poor rich, healing the sick, even curing transsexuals. The Philippines is a celebrity-mad religious country, but even here, there's never been a church like this. I believe, yes, I believe. Well, maybe it's more like a Tonight Show, but it appears his off-key singing doesn't deter the faithful. Oh, Brother Mike. We love him so much. And I have everything to thank the Lord for giving him to us. I believe. Brother Mike, to me, he's used by Lord Jesus Christ as an instrument to change many people's lives. And not only me, a lot of my friends and a lot of people you see around here. There are millions of them all over. And after the service, we are going to have dinner. With egg sandwich, but it's a mystery why he's so popular. He speaks for hours, his jackets are awful, and his message is straight from a self-help manual with a dollop of the devil thrown in. It's time for us Christians to get into where those demons and evil spirits are hiding. And exercise this power to trample upon his snakes and his scorpions. But the moment you rebel or reject that authority, you can be sure you will receive punishment because rebellion is a sin like witchcraft. Sigaw niyo, authority. Okay, hallelujah. Let's just say that uh, once I was lost, uh, but now I'm found. As, 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 as the lyrics of the song say, I used to be a uh, philandering husband. I, I drink a lot. I, I even gamble. Uh, that was my old life. But uh, when I heard Brother Mike uh, taught about or preached about uh, righteousness, it suddenly struck me I have to change. Okay, ulitin natin si El Shaddai ang nagbibigay ng tagumpay. Sabihin nyo, Brother Mike, okay, buksan niya ang gusto nyo. Brother Mike! I'm a bit concerned. Uh, uh, concerned in the sense that there's no way for me to back out anymore. If I only would have a way, I'll back out from it. It's really a uh, tremendous uh, responsibility. But I always say this is not my work, this is the Lord's work. His Excellency, President Fidel Valdez Ramos. Your goal is nothing less than spectacular. He's such a political force that even the Protestant president comes a-courting. And his religious broadcasting empire has made him so famous that everyone wants a piece of Brother Mike. Now there are moves for the kingmaker to become the king. Whatever is the Lord's uh, plan for me, I'll be there. And if the Lord calls you to be the president of the Philippines, what would you do? Uh, there must be so be, uh, some very strong indications that it's the Lord uh, uh, wanting me to be there. What, what indications would you look for? That is very hard to tell. But Brother Mike has bigger ambitions. He says the whole world needs him, not just the Philippines. So the church is expanding. It's coming soon to a country near you.